So yesterday was one of the craziest days. Yeah, you did right. So yesterday was one of the craziest days that I've ever had, bro. Alright, so we went to the Chick-fil-A Classic to see this nigga. Hold up. Let me make sure I don't say this nigga. Zion Williamson, not William. Zion Williamson. Yesterday we went to go see him play. Uh he dropped 53 points. He only missed three shots. He was like, what is what is it? They won 73 to uh 53. So he basically had the same amount of points that that Felton and them boys had. Alright, so before the game even started, bro, we was outside for a good two hours, bro. Because like everybody, it was like I'm gonna say a thousand niggas out there, bro. Nigga low key feel like his down. He told that nigga Tyler. You shit on camera, bro. No! And I got footage, my nigga. It was like a thousand niggas out there trying to uh try to get in, and it was like. So then the dude started coming out like, hey man, nobody else getting in, bro. It's too many people in the gym. Um, y'all niggas can go home. <laughs> So you already know what the black people did. Black people started, matter of fact, at first they were all calm. I'm not gonna say we because that was the ignorant black people. I'm, I'm ignorant, but I'm not that ignorant, bro. So I'm not gonna say we because we was all, we was all calm. The people on my side was calm. Here are the ticket. It's a ticket, bro. It's that ticket, my nigga. We was all calm. And I'm gonna be showing the footage throughout this, uh, I'm gonna say vlog story. Cause that's that's basically what it was. So we was all calm and everything, and we was like, "Well, we got tickets, so we can get in." You know what I mean? Like they got they reserved our seats. You know what I'm saying? Once you pay for the tickets, you can get in, bro. Wrong. They said, "Oh, we sold out." We was like, "All right, y'all sold out. We got tickets." Said, so, "Oh, it's not a guaranteed thing, right?" So the lady beside me was telling me, "Oh, it's not." Apparently they oversold the amount of seats that they had. I'm like, bro, what? I was like, wait a minute. So y'all finessing niggas because like, if you paid for this uh ticket, on it it says no refunds, no guarantee of admittance in gym if sold out. So basically you're telling me that the seats, these seats, are basically like if you get there first, like they're not reserved or anything. So I'm like, well dang, because we got there like around starting time. Bro, when I tell you that this is the door, right? This counts as one person. Right there, that's, that counts as one person. The line went like this. So we didn't have to wait in that line. Our line was like this big. It was like maybe 30, 40 people up in the line. So we like, oh, we got our tickets, so we, we good. It was like, nah, um, nobody else can come in. So these, these, uh, okay, some of them are white too, so I'm not even going. So they started kicking the window and everything. Like, this is at, this is after like an hour of being cold, my nigga. So I was low key getting, I was, I wasn't getting mad, but it was getting to me like, bro, like, let us in, my nigga. Like, bro, what you doing, bro? So started kicking the window. I'm like, dang, what the fuck is these niggas doing? So they start beating on the glass. I'm like, oh, these niggas is trying to break the glass. So I see this white officer walking down the stairs. I'm not trying to be racist. But I'm going to call it how it is because it was a white officer. There was a black officer. Both of them handled situations. So a white officer come down the stairs. This man said, I'm going to need y'all to back up. <laughs> Yo, them niggas. All right, so once he said that, he went back in. And them niggas proceeded to, like, pile on the door and, like, try to open the door. I'm like, bro, what are y'all niggas doing? So he come back, like, 10 minutes later. All I see is a swarm of black niggas running, bro. They're like, oh, oh, don't shoot. I'm like, what the, hey, yo, somebody got a gun? So I take off running, right? I knew, bro, I knew, like, look, bro, something told me, like, bro, that nigga wasn't going to start shooting in our direction, bro. Because at first I thought it was a random dude that had a gun, but it wasn't a random dude. It was the, it was the officer. He had his taser out, and they say he tased somebody. I'm like, dang, somebody got tased? Like that? So, so my man's so apparently dude got tased, and apparently he just went home because like it was like a, a group of people following him, like they was talking about man, we not gonna get in, bro. Y'all might as well go home and everything. So 
I don't know who got tased, but you can tell like some like something happened to something because they all, they were also over there fighting. Like I don't why well, fight, bro. So I don't know why them niggas was fighting. So you can tell like some people was just mad, like just pissed, bro. You can like see in their eyes. So I'm like either something happened to this nigga, or he just that mad, bro. So I don't know who got tased. I don't know who got into a fight, but people just started leaving, bro. So. Around the two-hour marker is when... No, around the hour and 40-minute marker, we went to the back. We went around back. Into the uh, game yet. After an hour, feel me? Um, they said they sold out, but we had tickets. You know what I'm saying? Um, so that means they, over, they oversold the tickets that they had. It's not possible. Hey. It's, 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 or there are some counterfeiting genius out here. Man, bro. They tripping. They tripping, bro. Um, they lot. If I see one more dude going to the door, I'm gonna have to. I might kick in the door, wave in the full floor. The flights are gonna be clean. Bro. That's all I'm saying. And like the point, the fact of the whole matter is that it was niggas trying to kick in the door, waving the full floor like they was Biggie Small. We waited inside line for an hour and thirty. I still know the back way from last time I came, bro. Unless they redesigned the fucking school. Me. It's crazy, bro. You know what I'm saying? I I don't know what to do. It's like, I feel like my time has been tampered with. You know what I mean? I feel like I got played. Um, I got out here, you know what I'm saying? I dressed up nicely, you feel me? It was, you know what I'm saying? Was, you know, I just came out here trying to watch, just tried to watch a basketball game. You see, I came out here with the North Face jacket on. The Nautica, um. Hold up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, this was the, the most brilliant plan, my nigga. So, the new the team that was um about to play, they were getting off the bus and everything, right? So, we was like, yeah. We about to finesse this. So, uh, as soon as they got off the bus, like, we, we started walking with them, right? So, we was walking. I packed. Bro, tell me why they coach is at the door, right? Tell me how fake this nigga is, bro. This nigga looked us in our face. He pointed at all the people. Oh, that's it. I'm like, what? 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 Bro, wouldn't you look out for the homies, bro? I would look out for the homies, bro. People from his school saying that they went to the school and everything. And my nigga didn't even let them in. I felt I, I felt mad for them niggas, bro. I'm like, yo, you not going to let your own niggas in, bro? You Hollywood as fuck. I'm from the first one. I missed my school play. Uh, I missed Dutch Fork's game. So... I was kind of bummed about that, my nigga. This lady from his uh, from his job, she was like, I can get y'all in. I'm guar I can guarantee y'all I can get y'all in. So my nigga shot was like, oh, bro, I had to plug the whole time. I didn't even know it. So uh, it's just two hours later. I'm looking like. But I was trying to be grateful. You know, you feel me? I was trying to be grateful. I was like. You what? Go around to the, to the back. All right, so. She told us she was like she's like um come this way because like we look suspicious. I'm like, alright, cool. So we go back that way and then she's like, Alright, so you take the Chick-fil-A cup. You take my name tag. She's like, now nah, I'm gonna say that you are you two are the cow handlers today. Or you're gonna be the cow or something like that. I was like, cool. And then as we're going back, yo, this lady on the, the lady at the front door was like she was nagging the kid, bro. Like she was she was annoying, bro. Like she like we we went back up there and then like the lady was like oh they're with me this is the cow handler this is the cow like these two are the cow people and then like he works there and stuff like that and she's like oh aren't y'all all supposed to have name tag she started touching on niggas I'm like yo I just kept on walking. I'm like nigga who are you bro like get the so we got in that way. <laughs> We finally got in that hole, bro. So we got in just in time to see this nigga Zion play. Bro. After that, that nigga was going crazy, bro. He had a double double. He had 16 rebounds. And the nigga's name, I'm gonna try to pronounce this. I am going to try to pronounce this. Hold on, where is it? Jalik Felton. Had 19 points. That nigga, bro, he got a handle. Zion jumping from almost the free throw line and added LeBron. Zion is a 6'7", 220-pound, five-star recruit. Nigga's 16 years old, bro. 
Niggas did not want no smoke with him. They was, they was getting out the way. They was running. He had a cross. He had a crossover. But he was missing his threes. But I'm pretty sure that he can make them threes. Matter of fact, he did a Hezo Mellow Jello fellow, my favorite color, yellow out this, bro. He was out there, yo. Jalik, how do you say his name? I, I'm probably butchering his name. He was also good. And that other guy on his team. But upon us getting out there, at first, I'm like, yo, this nigga Zion, low key, like, maybe he did that from his, from that little, from that, that windmill in there. Maybe he did that on a weak team, bro. Because I'm like, ain't no way he gonna come out here and dominate again, like, while I'm out here, while I'm out here in the crowd. You feel? Bitch, you thought. You thought. You thought. You thought. Not sadly. Like, gracefully, I was mistaken, bro. <laughs> This nigga, bro, like, dude, like, they would try to, like, he would get in the pose, like, he would do a move, he like, spin out, mm, bro, nigga went fast break, mm, I'm like, oh, sh oh, I'm like, damn, I'm like, who is this? Now, at this moment, I did not know that, um, that Jalik Felton was on the, uh, on the other team. So, bro, I see some nigga come out, spin off, I'm like, yo, who is this? That my nigga was like, yo, that's Raymond Felton's um cousin. I'm like, yo, what, nigga, who the, f bro, like, bro, this shit is lit, bro. And we still be, we going back on Thursday. I don't know if I'm gonna record it. Because I don't know like I could do a vlog on that, but I don't know if niggas really like like vlogs. That's why I didn't do this like whole vlog thing. But bro, like this nigga Zion was like, bro, at the half, they was like I think he had like 30, 40. I don't know, bro. They said some crazy number at the half. They was like, yeah, they got this and this. Oh yeah, Zion got this. And they was like, oh I'm like, yo, that this joke is getting crazy, bro. Alright, so He was just, he was eating, bro. So, that's, that's crazy, bro. That's crazy, bro. So, Zion had 53 points. M. Brown had four. Lindsley had eight. Zeke Felton, Zalik Felton, my fault. Had, Zelk, is it Zalik? Okay. Had 19. Juwan Gary had 14. They all took, they took, um, they took turns guarding Guarding this man, but Zion, like, nobody could stop him, bro. Like, he was just big. Like, he was just like a fucking train, bro. He's like LeBron, like, bro. Like, I don't mean to compare him to LeBron, but out there, he looked like LeBron. Like, for real. Like, you know how LeBron, like, kind of big, and then somebody tried to get on him, and he would just, roll, just, like, go past him. Like, that's how he was looking out there. And then he called for the, bro, I forgot. He called for the isolation. <laughs> Like, bro, he called for the isolation. He went further back to, like, half court. Nigga came through. He said, whew. Like, bro, crossed with his left. He said, whew. Went straight to the... Boom. I'm like, God. Bro, I'm surprised I didn't lose my voice out there, bro. Oh, my mom, bro. Like, this nigga. It was crazy, bro. And then, after that, my nigga... We had went, I, bro, we was lead, we had to leave the game early so we wouldn't get caught in traffic. After that, I touched down in my crib. I'm like, yo, I gotta tell this to YouTube, bro. So that's why I did not upload a video yesterday, hopefully. I mean, this video will go up either today or tonight. But dead ass, bro, if you can, go see Zion play. Apparently, he's playing again, and my nigga got tickets to that. You already know what it is, bro. Leave a like if you want to see a vlog of that, my nigga. But, bruh. Or I could just do this again. Or I could just do a story time with the uh, the footage up in there. 
It's been your boy. The bat. The bat. <laughs> Yo. It's my man Z Law right here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know my wrist be dancing crazy. Been on some fly. She had red balls. She was sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She had a bus on it. Yeah. 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 Yeah